Hello, welcome to Waypoint Survival. Today, we're in the beautiful Caribbean. We're gonna do some snorkeling, we're gonna do some walking around on the beach, explore some islands, so stay tuned. So here I am on a tropical island in the Caribbean and I'm just uh, doing some exploring of the island, kind of bushwhacking my way across and just kind of show you what my surroundings are at this point. And as you can see, nothing but uh, dense scrub and, and uh, you can even see here the undergrowth. It's very hard to get through here and uh, have no knife or machete. Just uh, bushwhacking my way through here. Yeah, this brush is really thick. Not impenetrable, but definitely, definitely challenging. So just walking along here, using the sun as my reference. And uh, I don't have a compass either. So I'm just trying to go from one side of the island to the other and see what I can see. made a little bit more difficult by the fact that there aren't any straight trails in through here. Just pretty much follow the path of least resistance. Try to find an open way. Of course everything is sandy and you can see ground thing around here. So 
So what we have right here is a fairly good size subterranean termite nest. And of course you can break some of this stuff off and burn it over a fire to help ward off mosquitoes. So far I've seen only one mosquito, but I'm sure that there's a lot more in here. And that's pretty, pretty neat find. Getting up a little higher here on the island and uh, heading up to one of the higher points here. And just kind of some of the rocky paths around it here. All right, let's see what we can see. Wow, this is a beautiful location. Ocean waves roaring. Beautiful secluded island here. And uh, just really enjoying walking along the beach and exploring. So when looking up and down a beach like this and you're trying to find a place to stay the night, an overhang like this is really great. You can see here the rock hangs over, goes back up in there pretty good ways. Yeah, it's a little rocky and sandy, but it would definitely be a good place to spend the night if you had to. Pretty good shelter, not the most comfortable. Probably lay down right in here a little bit, get some rest. Here's a very pretty little cove, mostly protected from the ocean. Nice little private beach. The only thing you would have to be careful about is the tides. They do come in here twice a day. So you could possibly use some of these dead trees here to build a shelter. But a lot of the scrub and pine uh, in here as well as some cedar type trees, of course the palms, but uh, very, very dense vegetation, very hard to get through. And of course, looking back the way I came, just really rocky uh, terrain, uh, obviously produced by volcanoes. And uh, but beautiful, just looking out the ocean there. Appreciate you all going along with me on this little adventure in the Caribbean and uh, wasn't a whole lot I could do uh, without uh, getting special permission for building shelters and starting fires and things like that but I thought you might find it interesting just some of the uh, adventures and the trips I've been having here uh, during this uh, very chilly part of November back in southern Ohio but down here in the Caribbean it's beautiful it's sunny and uh, pretty warm today about 82 degrees Fahrenheit so Thanks again for watching. This is James Bender for Waypoint Survival. Please like, share, and subscribe. Make sure and check the links in the description box below. And don't forget to check the bell button for all of our upcoming videos. And we'll talk to you next time.